massive floating beings of Jupiter, predicted by cosmologist Carl Sagan. Juno-Jupiter mission. What are these floating massive beings? Jupiter could be inhabited by giant, kilometer-wide beings that could be thriving off the planet's gases. This is what the famous world-renowned cosmologist claimed, Carl Sagan. The NASA historic Juno satellite is preparing to take off with scientific equipment and it's entering the orbit of the massive gas planet Jupiter. NASA experts already predict the discovery of quote-unquote alien life is possible to be viewed by this mission. But because Jupiter is a gas giant, alien life would be very different from what uh, we know as life forms. U.S. scientist Carl Sagan had a theory that life on Jupiter could take forms of enormous balloon-like life forms floating above the hot gases of Jupiter's surface. As we know, Jupiter is a gas giant. He said on his TV show Cosmos, a personal voyage, he says, that vast living balloons could be buoyant, pumping heavy gases from their interiors or by keeping their insides warm in this way. He said they might eat organic molecules in the air or make their own with sunlight. We call these creatures floaters, he said. He explained, we imagine floaters kilometers across, enormously larger than the greatest whale that ever was, being the size of whole cities. And, of course, he theorized that they would be passive creatures, that they would be bound to be predators or hunters, and he calls them that prey on these massive beasts. And he says, hunters are fast and maneuverable. They eat the floaters, both for their organic molecules and for their store of pure hydrogen. And he goes on to say, but there can't be many hunters because if they destroy all the floaters, they themselves will perish. And he has theories that organic molecules would fall from the sky, sustaining these floaters. For example, the whole point of the Juno mission is to learn what goes on with Jupiter, the biggest planet in our solar system, its history, its uh, astrogeology, which will uh, in turn help us to uh, learn more about life elsewhere in the cosmos. Carl Sagan said biology is more like history than it is like physics. You have to know the past to understand the present. Now already this spacecraft, the Juno spacecraft, captured stunning images of Jupiter's four moons orbiting it, as well as the sounds of Jupiter with eerie solar winds crashing into its uh, million, into the surface of it, million miles per hour. And this is on Express UK by Sean Martin. So we'll have to be patient and wait for the images to come back. Anything that they find, they will reveal to us, and we'll see if Carl Sagan was right as to what could be on there. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece, in Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.